Okay, so I can't get my new microphone to work. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I'll have to talk up a little bit so the audio isn't bad, <laughs> too bad. So um, uh, telling a story uh, today about um, uh, when I was living in North Hollywood and I moved into North Hollywood um, in a fourplex. It was four units like uh, front to back on Whipple Street, um, just about a half a block um, east of Vineland. And it was across the street from uh, grammar school. And I think we, I moved, moved in there with uh, Terry um, in, it was 96, I think. I think it was like the summer of 96. And um, when I was there, um, you know, there was like some kind of, initially we lived in the, first, in the second unit. And then when the woman that was kind of like the manager of the four units, she moved out um, to someplace, I guess, better. Um, she... She, uh, we, we moved into her unit because we liked her unit better, the front unit, because it had nice windows and everything. So anyway, so anyway, so we moved in there. Well, while we were there, this is a, kind of an uh, odd and interesting story. Um, the, uh, there was like a shed or something there. And, uh, you know, one time we were going through it, you know, probably around, you know, 96, or 97, something like that. Because I moved out, we moved out in, um. Uh, very tail end, like the actually was around April 1st of um, 1999 because that's when I bought my house on Running Meat and, and uh, like Balboa. But anyway, uh, there was a shed there, at, and at one point we were just going through stuff. And we found, you know, the interesting thing is what we found we found this um, uh, somebody's par participant uh, uh, badge, uh, 1980. And the Olympics, uh, this man named Bob Rogie or Rogi, or uh, you know, I'm not sure how to express, uh, say his last name, Ro Rogi, I think it is. Anyway, um, you know, track and field and stuff. So I thought, you know, it's like, okay, it's like, so it's like, I figured this guy must have at least, um, it, you know, at some point uh, lived there and that, you know, in the, and just accidentally forgot, forgot this badge there, you know, just didn't, you know, left it there and everything. So, uh, so when we left, you know, it's like, well, it's like, we'll just take it with us. And it, it's been in a box for a really long time. Um, and I would, you know, periodically run through, you know, run into it when I was living in Lake Balboa and then, uh, coming here, uh, down to Gardena, uh, over 10 years ago. Um, it's been in a box and I haven't seen it in at least 10 years. Um, and, but you know, it, the funny thing is, is that, um, about a month ago I was thinking about it and I said, well, I need to find him. And back then it's like, it was hard to find anybody, you know, it's like, you know, it's like, you know, who is this guy and everything. Um, you know, cause there, you know, inter, you know, there was no internet really. It's like at the end of the year there was, but you really couldn't find anybody, you know, back then. And, uh, uh, so what happened is, um, you know, it's like, so we got, you know, it's like I was been going through my stuff in boxes and so on. And it's like, and I was thinking about this month ago, you know, if I find this, I want to return it to, I'm going to find this guy. I should be able to find him on the internet or something and return it to him, you know, and, and contact him and return it to him. Um, uh, so anyway, um, I was going through one box that was more of a project, you know, it's like, and... Uh, and at the bottom of the box was was this, you know, I, I found it, you know, so I found it and I, you know, because I didn't know his name offhand before. It's like, so what I did is I um, uh, did start doing a Google search. It didn't take me very long at all. It's like initially I was looking on Facebook and I found somebody, this is a kind of an unusual name. So, I, you know, found a few people with that last name. I sent a message to one of them. And then, uh, and then I just did a general Google search, and then I immediately found information on him. Um, there were two things that I didn't know about him. He was a super athlete. Um, he was um, a world class javelin thrower, um, and I, had, you know, I had no, you know, no idea who he was or anything or anything about him. And the other very sad thing was um, that he had passed away. Actually, years before I even found this, back in like around 1997, he passed away in 1986 in an accident. He fell off of a truck or something, you know, at some training. Um, anyway, um, you know, which was really sad. You know, it's like I couldn't. You know, it's like it was just hard to believe. You know, it's like that. You know, not only was he, he had he passed away already, but he had passed away. He'd been passed away years before I even found it. So it's like it's kind of a mystery why it ended up in that. Um, uh, you know, in that storage, you know, that shed and everything in, in North Hollywood. The only thing I can think of is he, he probably knew somebody, somebody, somebody that lived in that, that complex, that four unit complex some years before 
probably just, you know, they knew him, they had it on him, and then they just, they left it there, and that's the only thing I can think of is that, um, that it was somebody he, he, you know, he may have only been slightly associated with uh, that, that guy, but um, they must have left it there, so... Um, so anyway, it didn't take me very long to find, you know, it's like I found, um, I actually managed to find an email address on a, the Find a Grave uh, um, website, findagrave.com, you know, there's a, there's a memorial for him, and I, I found, managed to find an uh, email address, and then what I did is I, uh, um, you know, it's like I email, emailed the person, and it turned out to be his younger brother, and so I've got his address, so um, it, uh, I'll be, you uh, sending this to him um you know it's like it's it's uh it's finally going home you know so after all of these years it's finally going to go home back to his family and so on 